I'd say two things. The main thing is getting away from the industrial brewing. So you could either go back in time and try to reinvent old techniques, or you can go ahead and make totally new beers. And in your brewery, what do you consider as innovative beers, or what would you consider your most innovative beers? Well, well, I, I, I'd say that the, the main thing is that we actually try to go back in time and reinvent the old-fashioned way of of brewing. That's the, that's the most innovative about our brewery. And what what is that old way? Uh, for example, uh, the, the lack of technology. We don't use pumps at all, but we have hoists, so we elevate our uh, barrels. So it just runs by gravity for the next vessel. That's, right. uh, and that's the that, gravity brewing you talked about. Yes, yes. For and example. what does that give to the beer? It, uh, it it gives that it doesn't spoil the beer uh, because, uh, in my opinion, a lot of the pumps uh, uh, tends to to to, uh, to be to not gentle enough to the. We have to go to the the molecules that the organic molecules is long chains and they can crash quite easily. And what's your background? Just curious. Uh, I'm a civil engineer. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm from business school. Oh, excellent. Uh, actually doing the recipes now, which is like totally out of my field. And what can, but... what can we think of in, from coming from you in terms of a crazy innovative recipe? Can you rephrase that? Uh, what would you think we can expect to come from you as a new innovative recipe? I think that going here, this uh, on this, just we went to Holland and we went here, and there's a lot about um, a lot about going out in nature around us, which we've already done. But it's like there's so many other things that I haven't looked at, and I think that maybe trying to move a little bit away from the hops and add something else could be really interesting to work with. Yeah. But that's going back in time again because the Vikings they didn't use hop. <laughs> oh, interesting. Actually, yeah. It came with the monks, uh, the Christian, the, the monasteries in the Middle Age, it came to Scandinavia. So uh, up to 1200, 1300, they used all kind of uh, other uh, spices that, than hops in the beer. Yeah.